Hey guys, welcome to the Little Mouse channel. What do we got today for Food Fridays, Matt? Alrighty guys, today we got some exotic animal meats. And we got wild boar, alligator, elk, kangaroo, and buffalo. We're gonna try them all for you today. Alright, so we're gonna go first with the boar. And just one thing to note that these aren't purely um, the animal. They are mixed with beef. So that might skew the actual flavor, but we're going to see if they actually can, you know, distinctly tell that it's an exotic animal. That tastes like, that tastes like chew beef jerky. Yeah, I the, mean it has a, like a, like the, the grated kind. It tastes know? like a, it's got like a little aftertaste of boar, but if someone just handed me this, and didn't tell me it was boar, I wouldn't, I wouldn't know. Yeah, no, I think this was like, if you blind taste tested me with this, I would think it was shredded beef jerky. Like it tastes exactly like it's that. It's got like an interesting um, flavor, but that's that's not the meat itself. Um, okay, so it is barbecue flavored, so that's what we're tasting. Um, but yeah, I can, I can hardly tell that that is even boar. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it definitely, yeah. It's it's very good. I like it. it. has a It has an amazing taste to it. But to be fair, boar is pretty similar to pig, anyways. Mm -hmm. So that is nothing, you know. Very true. All right, guys. Next up, we've got the buffalo beef stick. Mild. Let's go ahead. Hit this bad boy. Buffalo. All right. So we got the buffalo. We're gonna let Matt try it first, and uh, let me know what you think. All right. Here we go, guys. Hopefully, this one tastes more like a. Uh, Exotic animal than the uh, boar. Can you, taste it? Can you tell it's an exotic animal? It still, it still doesn't taste exotic. -y. I need to, yeah, no, I have to taste that again to really accurately gauge it. Okay, so this one you definitely can tell a little bit more that it is. Which one is it? Buffalo. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you can tell. This one has like a gamey kind of taste to it. It's, it's kind of slight. It's not over. Yeah, bad. I can't. I can't honestly. I, I really can't tell. Kind of tastes like a, a different a different sausage kind of. You know. All right. So we were just kind of sitting here and just wallowing in the taste of of that buffalo and. We discovered that you can actually taste in the aftertaste a very, it just tastes different. You know, it's, it's, it tastes like an exotic animal. So you, you definitely notice that later on, but when you're eating it, it definitely doesn't taste exotic. Right. Mm -hmm. okay. All right, up next guys, we've got elk. This is kind of like a beef jerky style strip we've got going on yeah, here. Yeah, so hopefully these will taste more like an animal that's not beef. So. Yeah, let's get right into it. It looks more like like a jerky than the other ones. The other ones are kind of like slim jim. Mm. Okay, yeah, this one definitely tastes different. This one tastes like something I've never tasted before. Yeah, no, that that's very interesting. The elk is actually, I approve of the elk. It's nice, I like it. It does have a very hickory taste, but that's also the flavoring. Um, but you can definitely tell that this one is mixed, you know, with an elk. Mm -hmm. I mean, you can't necessarily tell it's an elk, or at least I can't, because I don't, I'm not too familiar with elk, but you can tell that it's not beef. That one's pretty good. Did you like it, Matt? Yeah, no, I really like, like, I approve of the elk meat. It was amazing. I love it. Up next, we got kangaroo. And in Australia, people actually eat this like we eat. Um, deer or venison. So we're gonna go ahead and try it. I like it. It's 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 it kind of tastes like sausagey almost. I want to mm -hmm. say it tastes. Oh yeah, very now that sausage. I got the flavor, like because it's got like flavoring in it. Once you get the flavor down and just taste the meat itself, I like that. Yeah, no, it's very yeah, nice. It does taste a lot like venison. People who say it does taste like venison, it, it, it does taste a lot like venison if you ever had um, deer. That's good. No wonder they eat it a lot. 
Some alligator, not crocodile, but alligator. And this one, just even by looking at it, you can tell. It's dark. Um, doesn't really look like beef. Okay, this is this is a little gamey. Oh yeah, this is gamey. Mmm. I don't know if I like that, man. I like it. No, I don't it's know. It's gamey. It's got like a. I hate to say it, but it's almost got like a swampy taste. Man, I, no, I don't know if I. Ooh, it's like a fishy aftertaste. I don't know if I can get down with that. What did you have to say about the alligator, man? No, I definitely don't like the alligator. <laughs> if there's anyone that was bad, it's the alligator. Like, it's giving me a fishy aftertaste in my mouth, and I'm just not liking it. I'm not into it. This one is, like, gamier, and you really have to chew this one a little bit more. Mm -hmm. Oh, no, definitely. You can definitely tell in the texture of it. This one is kind of tough. Mm -hmm. Well, also, it's an alligator. The animal's a lot different. <laughs> Alright, so we're gonna get Matt again in the future, hopefully for July. I was looking on Amazon, they got a bunch of other ones. They got Worm, they got Shark, Snapping Turtle. So are these all in the style of like a beef jerky or Slim Jim? No, the new ones that I'm, I'm going to order are pure. There's no beef mixed with it. So they are pure Snapping Turtle, pure Shark, pure Worm. Pure. They have like scorpion, spider, um, snapping turtle. They had all these flavors. Pure rabbit. They have tons of different stuff. So we will definitely try those in the future. So what do they got to do, Matt? They gotta subscribe, like the channel, leave us with comments. Hey guys, we love comments. Anytime you write us a comment, we love it guys. We absolutely love comments. If you have any suggestions of things that you'd like to see on the show, you know, anything. If you have any suggestions, any comments, definitely, definitely hit us up in the comment section below. We look at every single comment and, and leave them out. And I reply to every single one. Mm -hmm. So he'll definitely take a look at it. You don't have to worry about that. So once again, thank you guys for watching this episode of Little Mouse Channel. Of Little Mouse Food Friday.